Welcome to the homework for Lesson 29. This is Module 2 of Grade 1. Please write your name first. And just like the last homework was bringing back, making tens to add, this one is bringing back, taking from 10 to subtract. And we're going to apply it to word problems. And we're going to use steps very similar to the ones we did in our last homework. So here's our first section. And here's an example of what the answers are going to look like just for this section. 17 minus 8. So it's been a while since you've practiced taking from 10. So this, this may help to see it. 17, right, is 10, 7. 10 minus the 8 is 2, and then we add the remainders left, right? Then that would be 2 left there, and then we just add the 2 and the 7 back together again. 2 plus 7. Add the leftovers back together to see what's left. 9. So the answer is 9. All right, 16 minus 7. 16, remember that's 10. 6, right? Subtract 7 from the 10. We'll have 3 left. 10 minus 7, 3 left. And then we add the parts, the 3 and the 6, and we'll add the leftovers back together to see what we have left. 3 plus 6, 9. Solve. It says, write the two number sentences for each step to show how you take from 10. Remember to put a box around your solution and write a statement. Yvette counted 12 kids at the park. She counted three on the playground and the rest playing in the sand. How many kids did she count playing in the sand? So remember, here's this 12. It's a 10 and a 2. 10, 2. So... We're going to take the 3 from the 10, because it's too big to take from the 2. So 10 minus 3 is 7. And we add the leftovers. Right, there's 7 left of that 10. And now we add the leftovers back together. 7 plus 2 is 5. Oops, no it's not. 7 minus 2 is 5. 7 plus 2 is 9. Nine. So we need a, now we need a statement. Uh, she counted nine kids in the sand. Eli read some science magazines. Then he read nine sports magazines. If he read 18 magazines all together, how many science magazines did Eli read? Now, I'm going to assume that Eli didn't read them all at one time. Because that's, that's a lot of magazines to read all at once. So, 18 magazines minus nine equals... And, let's see, yep. 18 minus 9. So, uh, 18, that's 10, 8, right? So, 10 minus 9 is 1, right? Because there'll be 1 left from that 10. And now we just add the parts together. 1 plus 8, 9. Eli read 9. science magazines. Right, there's how you spell science magazines right there. On Monday, Paulina checked out six whale books and some turtle books from the library. If she checked out 13 books in all, how many turtle books did she check out? Well, we know that the whole is 13, right? 13. 
and one of the parts is six, and it's going to equal the other part, which is the turtle books. So 13 is 10, 10, 3, and 10 minus 6 is 4, right? So there's only 4 left of that 10 after we subtract the 6 out from it, and we just add these two parts back together, 4 plus 3, 7. Seven, she checked out. Seven turtle books. Some children are at the park playing soccer. Seven are wearing white shirts. If there are 14 children playing soccer in all, how many children are not wearing white shirts? So that's 14 playing in all. We're going to subtract the uh, 7 wearing white shirts. Let's see how many are left. 14 is 10 and 4. 14, 4, 14. Subtract 7 from the 10, there'll be 3 left, and we'll, then we'll add the parts together. So it's 10 minus 7 equals 3, and then the 3 plus the 4. Right? Add the leftover parts back together to see how many there are all together that are left. 7. Uh, 7 are not wearing white shirts. Or 7 are not. Are not white shirts. Dante has nine stuffed animals in his room. The rest of his stuffed animals are in the TV room. Dante has 15 stuffed animals. How many of Dante's stuffed animals are in the TV room? So he has 15 total stuffed animals and we're going to subtract the nine in his room and that will tell us the other part of the 15 which are the ones in the TV room. So 15 is 10, 5. 10 minus the 9 is 1. 1 plus the 5. Right? We're putting the, there'll be 1 left of that 10. And then we're just going to add the leftover parts back together. 6. 6. Of. Dante's Dante stuffed animals are in the TV room. 